Good. Well, res virtual is a core part of my life. It's been, I've been taking it since I was 34. And uh, it, it's gone in and out of fashion. You know, the, the media, old media, likes to be, you know, swing this way, swing that way. But the science has been pretty much direct on, which is every week there's another study coming out, either in cells or in animals and every few months in people, um, touting or showing that there are benefits. And there are no no downsides that I'm aware of. So what thousands of papers now have shown is that resveratrol uh, enhances the body's ability to repair itself. Um, it protects organs in animal studies. And in, even in human studies, it's shown some benefits. Uh, for example, lowers blood sugar levels, which is what we think is important for overall longevity. And it, it has even shown some uh, benefits in Alzheimer's patients in an, an Australian study that was done a few years ago. Um, so I, I've been taking resveratrol at a gram a day with a day off every couple of weeks just to give my liver uh, a, a chance to rest. But other than that, um, it's been a staple. And the, the other thing I want to mention is that resveratrol is, is one of the best known molecules for uh, preventing cancer, at least in animals. We don't know in humans. That's a longer study. But I take it for all those reasons. And it's a very safe molecule. It's been in our diet for thousands of years, though not in the quantities that I'm taking, of course. I take a gram. And if you often people ask me, would I get it from red wine? The answer is yes, but you'd need to have a 200, 300 glasses a day of red wine, which I do not recommend. Also, don't forget, as we've mentioned before, to mix it with something oily or fatty or a lot of protein. So a little bit of yogurt, Greek yogurt's great, it dissolves. Yeah. So I'm not big on having a lot of protein, especially early in the morning, but I know it does dissolve. So in the case of a zero fat Greek yogurt, do know uh, from past experience that it does dissolve well in that if, if Greek yogurt zero fat is your kind of thing. Well, it's really important to look at the color of the molecules. Go online, look at what color a, a, this molecule should be. Mm -hmm. um, so some of them are yellow, berberine and quercetin. Uh, for eating is they're generally yellow, should be bright yellow, not dirty yellow. Resveratrol is different. Resveratrol is a, a light gray color, but very fluffy. It'll, it won't dissolve in water. This is why we mix it with food. And if it comes out brown, you can open up the capsule, look at it. I often open up the capsule and put it into my food. I don't swallow it with food. I mix it. Uh, if it's not light gray or really close to white, it's full of other stuff. And some of the, that brown stuff that's in there causes diarrhea. And, and that's probably the least of the problems that could occur. So I, I really look for really pure substances with my supplements. I look for 98, 99% pure supplements because it's this other, you know, 30% sometimes that is, could be contaminants that could you, could do you long-term harm over decades of use. So for example, there's a product, uh, not product, there's a, there's a substance called FOTI, F -O -T -I, and that has a lot of resveratrol in it. Now that's been used for thousands of years in China. And, and that I think is, is um, you know, an example of you can choose to have a, a biological product that's been taken uh, by people for thousands of years. But it's this the products that are trying to pretend to be pure that are not pure that I avoid. Yeah, so the, the molecules that we're talking about here are activating mm -hmm. sirtuins. And they, so resveratrol acts like the accelerator pedal, NAD is the gas mm -hmm. or the petrol if you're in a, a different uh, country. And together they, they rev up the sirtuins. So why is that important? Because the sirtuins and NAD uh, ramp up in activity in the morning. Mm -hmm. It's part of the circadian rhythm, the daily diurnal cycle, as it's called. And you want your, your body to be in sync with itself. Otherwise, you have jet lag and you get yeah. tired. And so I take these molecules um, almost without exception in the morning. I feel this boost of energy because of it. And if I take them late at night, often I don't sleep well. So... That's very important. There are other supplements uh, such as metformin, vitamin D, K2, fish oil that I know, or at least I, the science says they don't affect sleep-wake cycle. So I take those at night instead.